Okay, Kalina, thank you so much. Breaking news in Cudahy, where one teenager was killed in a shooting and a 15-year-old victim was rushed to the hospital. KCAL News reporter Cara Finstrom is live at the scene where a family tracked their son's phone to that area. Cara. Yes, such a difficult morning for these families. We know a 15-year-old now fighting for his life. That 17-year-old died in the middle of the street behind us here. Detectives are now speaking with the father, who we first told you about earlier this morning. He was here trying to track down his missing 17-year-old son, whose cell phone kept pinging here. We believe we are speaking to the father. Uh, we're still trying to confirm the identity of the victim to confirm that he is the relative. So our thoughts and prayers go out to the family. From what I can tell, looking at the area, there's a lot of gang graffiti. So I hope these two boys were not involved in some type of uh, lifestyle like that. It's, a, it's definitely a tragedy uh, for their families. Family members have been comforting one another as they wait to learn more from those deputies. Sheriff officials say they don't know yet if and how these two teenagers knew each other and if they shot each other or they're looking for a suspect. Deputies who were in the neighborhood responding to an unrelated call, they heard the gunfire, rushed over. They did try to resuscitate that 17-year-old. He died here. They found the 15-year-old outside a nearby apartment building. He's in surgery in critical condition. Detectives say at least one of the teenagers is from a different area of Los Angeles. Now, they are out here, as you can see, behind us right now. They've been speaking with neighbors, also looking for any security camera footage as they try to make some sense of what led to this violence. All right, Cara, thank you.